Hello and welcome to the IT Convergence User Productivity Kit tutorial series. This is a demonstration of how to edit input text in a frame bubble using the Oracle UPK Developer. The UPK Developer offers options to modify input text. You can add additional entries to be displayed in the Know It and Do It modes, replace input text in all three modes, delete entries, change the default entry, or clear the string input list. In addition, the available options allow you to have multiple concrete entries, which are specific text that can be entered, and several meta entries, which allow for a range of non-specific text in the Know It and Do It modes. After recording a string input action in a topic, you may decide that you would prefer other text to be displayed in the action. To replace the input text on the current frame, select the String Input Option icon and choose Replace Text from the Frame Properties tool pane. Enter the desired text and click OK. By default, every string input action has two entries listed in the input text list. The text you entered and something. These entries restrict what users can enter in the try it mode to exactly the text that you entered while still allowing users to enter any text in know it and do it modes. If you want to add additional possible entries for the try it mode or use the anything or blank entries, you can delete the something entry. Also, if you would decide not to use concrete entries, you can also delete them. To delete input text from the current frame, click the input text list box and click the entry you want to delete. Click the string input options and choose delete entry. If you have deleted an entry from an input text list, you might want to add another concrete entry to the list. To add a new text to the input list for the current frame, click the string input option icon and choose add new text. Enter the desired text and click OK. If you have deleted the meta entry something from the input text list, you can add another meta entry such as anything, something, blank, or no meta entry. Note, it is not possible to add the something or anything entries if the input text list includes more than one concrete entry. Also, you can only include one meta entry in the input text list for a string input action. To add meta entries to the input text list for the current frame, delete any existing meta entries or any multiple concrete entries. Click the string input option and choose add anything, add something, or add blank. After recording a string input action in the topic and adding a new text, you may decide that you prefer to use one of the new concrete entries as default. To set the default input text entry for the current frame, click the input text list box, click an entry from the string input options icon and choose set to default. If you want to remove all the entries from the input text list except for the default entry, you can clear the list. To clear the input text entry list from the current frame, click the string input options icon and choose clear list. Note, after replacing, deleting, or adding input text or set new default for the string input action, you have to recapture or edit the affected screenshots. This concludes our tutorial on how to edit input text in the frame bubbles using Oracle's UPK developer. On behalf of IT Convergence, I'd like to thank you for your time and invite you to join the IT Convergence YouTube channel where you can learn more about the user productivity kit, features, and functions.